In this video I've just got an old hip flask and it's it's really tatty. Uh, it belonged to my partner's granddad and he passed away and it was handed on to me. And uh, you can see a lot of the silver on it's all gone really bad on there. And what I want to do is just clean that up a little bit. And a lot of people have been asking about cleaning up and maintenance of their blades and how they can keep them clean. And uh, all I use is a miracle cloth. And uh, you can buy these. They're about three, three pounds, something like that, four pounds. You get a big cloth of it. It's all natural material and you just literally rub it on. You can leave that to dry or you can rub it on or really give it a polish. The dirtier the cloth gets, the better it works. And you can see straight away already it's coming up shining. You can get this same with any any of your nice high carbon or stainless steel, any rust marks or anything like that that you've got coming up. This here will just uh, quite easily take it right off and clean it right out and you can get it looking really good. And then we're going to work on the neck a little bit and see how much we can do with this to bring it up. Non-toxic, so it is, it's pretty safe. Although afterwards I'll give this a little bit of a wash and uh, a clean down. And you can see that it's just literally cutting through the dirt and the grime on that. It's just literally cuts through it. And anyone with a patina that they don't want on their knife or their knives are starting to patina, these miracle cloths will uh, take that right off, giving you that professional shiny look. <coughs> it's a bit of a job that I've been meaning to do for a while and uh, I thought I'd spend a bit of time on it. Now, while they're all out. I'll, be, I'll even do the neck. I'll give that a good wipe off. Later on, I'll give it a good wash. So when I'm sipping on me whiskey, I won't be tasting a miracle cloth. Inside the flask, if you want to give it a clean out, a little bit of bicarb bicarbonated soda, a little bit of you know hot water won't hurt this flask at all. And uh, you just got to be a little bit careful because this has got an old proper cork seal in there which is uh, quite unusual to see now a lot of them have the old rubber seals then that's why I wanted to do this and use this little hip flask this is probably taking off so you know 20 30 years worth of uh, grime and uh, no problems at all you get that professional look with it it's not hard work you know the cloth's doing all the work I'm not doing all the work I really want to give it a good shine up, make it look the part again. If you've got angles that are difficult to get into, you can stretch your cloth over and just move it backwards and forwards and you'll see it just polishing all the time. I had a friend who put a patina on his knife in there and it didn't come out quite as he planned. Uh, it was a Mora number one. And what took him five hours to do with this uh, cloth took me about five minutes to take it back to a high carbon polished steel. And uh, well worth the money, I suppose, if you're into that knife game all that nice business and you want to look after your blades and then you can get yourself a soft cloth which I should have over here somewhere just a soft cloth like you would use and then you just polish it up and you can see straight away A lovely polished finished on it and then again with the top
and I'll say I use this cloth on my knife blades when they're getting dirty or when they're looking patinaed and I don't want that patina this polish, this cloth will take that right off and there you go so I don't know how long he had this flask, probably a very very long time and uh, what we'll do is we'll put a little bit of gun oil on this leather and just put a bit of gun oil on it and uh, do that up it'll look fantastic but that's that all polished up looks quite good now a lot better than what it was maybe a little bit more work to do on the inside there I'll have another go at that in a minute so that's just one way of keeping all your stuff clean and polished miracle cloth guys absolutely fantastic bit of kit so with that in mind I'll see you all on the next one